A road trip is the classic summer vacation, and we were inspired by National Lampoon's vacation to take you on a tour of a city with an unexpected summer pulse, my adoptive hometown, Kansas City, in honor of the new movie, Vacation. Holiday Road. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Going to Kansas City. <laughs> Kansas City, here I come. Barbecue. Like, is it Missouri or is it Kansas? Jazz. Kansas City is arguably the best kept secret in America. Nicknamed Paris of the Plains, we're going to show you some cool spots like this. Union Station that were featured in and inspired some big time movies. My friends are already in the RV. Yep, we're going on a movie trip. building featured in Robert Altman's 1996 film Kansas City was once the second largest transportation hub in America. Only the Grand Central Station in New York City was bigger. Now a center for all types of activities, restaurants and museums, it's hard to believe this grand palace almost faced the wrecking ball back in the early 90s. Well I remember there were scenes from Altman's Kansas City at Union Station and I, uh, I remember before they did that. He, they, that production kind of refurbished half of Union Station and I think was a great motivating factor for then doing something with Union Station. I remember growing up my whole life, my dad saying, I wish they would do something with Union Station. They're saying, it's historically significant and it's beautiful. We have arrived at the 18th and Vine Historic Jazz District, once the epicenter of Kansas City during the 1930s. This area was once party central, as captured in the movie Kansas City. You can even still see some of the facades that were created for that movie. Today, the district has plenty to see. It's home to the American Jazz Museum, the Gem Theater, Negro Leagues Baseball Museum, the Blue Room Jazz Club, and the Mutual Musicians Foundation. This area is a historical home run. A trip to Kansas City wouldn't be complete without tasting some of its authentic barbecue. It's time to eat! And there are more barbecue restaurants in Kansas City than anyone can count. We're at Arthur Bryant's Barbecue on the edge of the 18th and Vine Historic Jazz District. It's considered to be the most famous barbecue restaurant in the United States. Want proof? Celebrities, dignitaries, and a gang of presidents have all eaten here. And they've been perfecting their barbecue since 1908. Ribs and burnt ends? Mmm. Oh, this is the real deal right here. That was so good. When you get sick of the RV and it's time to chill, Head to the beautiful Hotel Phillips in downtown Kansas City, where Sasha Baron Cohen famously stayed and filmed a scene in their Missouri suite for the movie Bruno. Talk about a crazy scene. I heard the entire staff was in shock that day. Known for its art deco decor and celebrity clientele, this historic boutique hotel is one of Kansas City's best. The four of us are gonna take a little trip. Paris. Hmm? No, much better. We're driving to Wally World. What? We're going to Wally World! Road trip, worlds of fun, the Kansas City equivalent of Wally World. What should we ride first, the Patriot or the Mamba? Yes, I'm so glad we're the first ones here. 